go, go, go. Good morning, beautiful people. So this morning, I totally forgot, but <laughs> I remember now. Thank you, Faith. Well, a few months ago, we bought tickets to go to the Yoga Day Festival in Brisbane. I've never been to a yoga festival before, but I think it sounds like so much fun. Fun. We're going to take you along and show you what it's like. So exciting. You excited to go to the yoga festival, Jason? Yeah. spent the day at the yoga day festival and it was pretty awesome I got in a little bit of meditation and a tiny little bit of yoga but it's a bit difficult to do because Jason just wanted to do his own thing but that's okay there was a kids zone there and Jason absolutely loved the kids zone so that was awesome and now we're heading home because it's getting late and Jason is worn out and exhausted that was awesome the festival was really good the events that they had were really good they had a little kids area where they had coloring and they had like little arts and crafty sort of things to do for the children and jason absolutely loved that area when i was doing the meditation jason actually found a friend which was awesome and he ran around and played with his little friend the whole time while i was just doing my meditation which was good I got to do a little bit but I was sort of like just keeping my eye on him as much as I could while I was trying to meditate when we were eating lunch she found some new other friends as well and they literally spent that whole time running around a big tree it was so cute Jason literally just um, forced his way in but he saw a brother and sister wrestling each other and he's just dived on top of them and joined in <laughs> it was so funny but the kids absolutely loved it they had a blast and then the last event that we did was just a, a yoga session and Jason joined in and did some yoga and then he started doing his own own yoga and there was a bunch of other adults that uh, went and copied him so it was really funny so he was doing lots of like three-legged 
legged dogs, downward facing dog. They absolutely loved it and they, they copied everything he did and they reckon he's a really good little yogi. So we made new, more friends there. So the thing that I liked the best about this event was the environment. It was so chilled out. Everyone there was so relaxed and so happy. Like it was just one of those lazy Sunday mornings. I don't know if you know this by now, but I am obsessed with food. I think I spent 24-7 thinking about food. The food there was amazing. Everything that I saw there was vegan, which was good. And there was uh, raw vegan selections as well. We had a PBC acai bowl. It was like peanut butter and acai with bananas and fruits and stuff with a bit of coconut yogurt on top. It was really yummy. We had a vegan iced chai and then we got a donut eat. I know it's not raw, I know it's not like just because it's vegan doesn't mean it's healthy for you but I couldn't resist when I saw it because it's so rare that I get to eat donuts. So Jason had a cookies and cream donut and I had a peanuts donut so that was yummy, really yummy. And there was uh, some stalls there as well so you could buy like yoga gear and you could buy they were selling these re these organic yoga mats that were really awesome. They were made by a lady in New Zealand. If I could remember the brand, I will, I will like link it down below. We had so much fun. It was so relaxed and so chilled out. Everyone there was so happy. Everyone thought Jason was really cute running around. The music was so cool, so chilled. Like. I was starting to get a bit slack in my yoga practice so I, I'm trying to do yoga every single day because I feel like that's a healthy practice for me it just gives me some time for me every single day because I'm basically being a single mum all year so it's really important for me to carve out time for myself having that time every day for myself is really good and it it really helps with my mental clarity I feel like I can cope with everything a lot better when I do yoga every single day even if it's just five to ten minutes a day just it gives me a focus point it gives me something else to think about it clears my mind it helps me rejuvenate myself for the day but I let it slip um, recently just because I've been distracted by um, this whole process of downsizing our house and this has just given me the biggest motivation to start up again and get back into a daily routine. I think the next uh, yoga festival I will definitely be there and I want to see you guys there too. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my videos and if you like the topics that I talk about and the things that we do please please help support us and subscribe to our channel because I want to keep doing this I want to keep making content for you guys stuff that you enjoy if there's something that you want to know that about us please please comment below and ask questions uh, I, I'm curious to know what you guys like I'm curious to know what you guys want to want from us <laughs> want to see from us thank you so much for watching bye